Hello, my friends. It is time for another episode of a 30 second card in five minutes. And I will be honest, this time, usually I always say, oh, Ken said he'd take me to dinner tonight. Well, we can't because we have a family barbecue tonight, which will be fun, don't get me wrong. But I'm not sure I have as much incentive this time, so I'm just kidding. We'll see, we'll see. I get to go see my nephew, so I'm very excited. So, we're gonna do another 30 second card in five minutes, or five minutes, or whatever. If you've never seen one of these episodes before, please go back and watch the first one because I pretty much can guarantee you're gonna laugh. I even laugh when I watch it because it's now, what, like three and a half years old and, and it's kind of funny. So every month we release a new um, episode. And this time I have on my desk, and of course I always have random stuff. It's usually the new stuff because that's what I've been working on. I have award to stamp. I have uh, circles for awards. I have banners to cut, because those all kind of go together. I have uh, mini hexagons for backgrounds. I even have a Katie, I'm sorry, Kirsten to love, but I don't, I don't see how that's gonna kind of coordinate together. And then I have dies just in case, because I'm gonna, I'm gonna see if I can try to cut stuff out. So I have my band, I have this set, which you can see it here, so it's better. But this is the Sizzix set, so these dies coordinate with some of those products I just showed you. So I have that here. I also have my zigzag circles from Sizzix, just in case I would think I'm gonna cut out an award or something, I don't know. I have, I have quite a bit here. I have all my ink pads, I have my blocks, I have my die cut machine, ooh. And I even have my magnetic platform. Very excited about that. You'll have to check out the video on that. So I'll probably be using that because now I don't need to use post-it notes. So imagine how much money I'm gonna save on my handy dandy post-it notes. Poor, poor uh, 3M is probably very disappointed. Anyway. I'm excited. I Oh, these are the colors I had. I um, My mind's eye sent me some paper because I'm teaching at a store. I mean, I'm teaching at a Creating Keepsakes University. And so they sent me some really pretty paper. And this is something that I can't tell you what it really was because it was something else, but it's very exciting that's coming out soon. But I'm gonna use it as scrap paper and I think I'm gonna try to use some of the, look at, oh my gosh, look how pretty that paper is. I love this. My mind's eye is fabulous. So then I picked some of my cardstock that coordinates with this paper. So I have corn flour that matches my Dun, da, 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 corn flour ink pad. And then I have bubble gum, which dun, da, 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 matches my bubble gum ink pad. Oh, and I should have grabbed some buttons just in case, but oh well, because I have buttons that match the court, that match everything, you know, it's got to all go together. Okay, so I have no idea what I'm doing. So we're just gonna, oh, and I have white here too. That's probably a good idea to have some white just in case. So I don't know what we're doing. We'll just start the time. Ken's over there, ready to start the time, and we'll see. I have no idea. I thought that's half the fun, right? Who cares? Okay, Kenny. I don't even have a plan. I don't even, sometimes I even think what am I, I don't have no, okay, just start the time and we'll see what happens. <laughs> Are in your marks? Get set, start the time. Okay. okay, so now what I wanna do is I wanna stamp the back of my, because I just, you know, cardstock sometimes, I, you know me, I like to make my own car, um, background paper. So we're just going to add this on the background just to give it a little extra oomph, you know? I mean, it needs to have, you know, um, and I'm gonna line this up here, so I want it this to be centered. But, you know, I just want it to be a little bit more than just a plain piece of cardstock. So making your own background paper is fabulous. Now, of course, you always wanna press where the stamp is, and this is a large stamp, so you have to use your secret weapon, otherwise you're not gonna get a perfect da -da -da impression. Okay, so I have that. Now what I wanna do is I need to do some die cut. I need to, okay, so I want to, Let's see, let me think. Okay, wait, okay. Okay, so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna run this through my machine and I think I just want that and that. So I'm just gonna run that through. That pattern paper is so pretty, it's hard to cut it. It's like you need to buy extra of it just so you can have it to look at. Okay, so that's gonna be my like my front. So, but I need some, I need pink back there too because that's way too much corn flour for one little, um, well, you know what, wait. Maybe, it, maybe, it, maybe it'll be okay, hang on. Okay, too much thinking, too much thinking. Okay, so let's do, I want to do, uh, uh, dream big, dream big. I like dream big. I like to say dream big because that, that just kinda, and I think we might get away with stamping it on here because I just realized I don't have any circle dies here which is gonna kinda bum me out. So we might have to change this up a little bit. So let's try this, dream big, let's see if that works. Oh, yeah, it actually does. That's pretty impressive. Okay, so we're gonna do that, but then I want to do some, I need to make some banners. And which banner do I wanna use? I'm gonna use this one. So the fun thing is, is sometimes I don't get to play with the stamps. So this is even extra fun that when I make these videos, I actually get to play with the stamps. 
because sometimes I'm too busy doing a hundred other things. Okay, so I think I put it on the block straight. <laughs> it's not it's not on straight. It might be an idea to put it on straight. It was a little it was a little curved. So we'll do that one more time there. And we'll do another one because ah, you don't want it to die, die cut out wrong. Okay, so we're gonna tear this to make sure it'll go through the machine. Now I need that die. Where's that die? These envelopes, oh, always cover your ink pads. They will not dry up, but you will put your hand in it, guaranteed. So I gotta find the dies that match. Luckily, because I designed these, I have two of these, so I get to cheat just a little bit because I have two sets. Ha ha, ha ha. Two sets, cheater, cheater, pumpkin eater. Okay, so I'm gonna line that up, get exactly, now, no, look, look, no hands, no post-its. Woohoo! magnetic platform, I love you. I love you. Coming out September 2013. Okay, so now, got that, move that off to the side. So now I have this, I have this, I have this, I have this, but you know what? Hang on, let me see. I, I'm not feeling that background, hang on. Not feeling the background, I'm not feeling the background. Okay, let's do this. Let's try trimming this to four and trimming it to, I have to take off a little tiny bit because I'm really not feeling that background as much as I expected to. Or is I, oh, that's gonna, <laughs> that's not gonna work. That sucks. Uh, let me see. Oh my gosh, I hate when I'm being timed. It freaks me out. Uh, I, oh, oh, hang on, hang on. Let's think about this for a second. Let's do, Hang on. Ooh, let's do that. I, we just need more color. See, I'm, I'm putting the card together and I'm just kind of going, I'm not really feeling this because I feel like there's too much going on behind it. Oh, you know what? This is what we're gonna do. We are, we're seriously gonna do this. This is like a total, oh crud, the postman's coming. We're even just gonna go, bye-bye oh, hexagons. That didn't work. And sometimes you just have to let it go and just say, you know what, it's not gonna work. I'm going to move on because obviously this is supposed to be a fast card and it's not supposed to be a card that you think about for four years and I don't have four years to think about it because I have to go see my nephews. So I'm gonna line this up. So it's kind of like a, whoops, I kind of messed up, but you know what, we're gonna fix it kind of thing. And I see that there's way too much white on here and that's really, really freaking me out. So what we're gonna do, oh, I got it, I figured it out, okay. Take off all that. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna clean our hexagon stamp. I got it, I got it. And we're going to ink it with the bubble gum. And the bubble gum is nice and light, but I don't know how light it's gonna be on the white. So I'm testing it on this. Whoa, where are you going? Testing it on that. Um, and then you know what? I think I'm gonna do second generation on this one. So I get just a little bit of pink, but not a lot of pink. Just enough texture for someone to say, did you do something to that background? Because I think that's gonna add exactly, yes. That's it, that's it. Whew! I can redeem it. Oh my gosh, where'd the other little piece go? Where'd the other little piece go? Oh crud, oh crud. Oh, there it is, whew! Gosh, this is just falling apart. I think I need a vacation. Okay, so we're gonna drop, oh, this is so much, you're gonna like this so much, I like this so much better. Okay, so then, and almost done. Kenny, I'm almost done and I don't even know where you went and I'm gonna freak out if you're not in here to stop the time. So stop the time! Oh, I looked at it, you're, you know what? I swear you're fired. It was 6.08, I swear you're fired. You know what, seriously, you owe me big time. You're dust. No, it was not 6.17, it took you seven minutes to run in here, or practically seven, it was 6.08, I looked at the little white one. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna come back in here. What are you doing? Why weren't you in here to watch my fabulous card watch me mess up so much? Okay, so here, no, but you know what? I'm so thankful, and I, look, there's, I didn't clean it in the perfect spot in that very corner, but I'm so thankful I changed that background. Did you see how the blue, um, the, it was just too dark when I was showing you, the, the blue just kind of overwhelmed the card, and in all honesty, I think what I would do is, uh, I'm gonna to totally cheat. And I'd probably end up adding some twine to the top because look how cute this twine is. My twine I get from the twinery, they're fabulous, I love them. But um, I, I, when we stop the time, I'm gonna tie some, 
some cute little ribbon up at the top. But I did get it stamped on the back, and I did this. And Kenny, you're gonna, like, when you edit this video, you're gonna have to see all the things that I did to this poor little card before I created this card. We know, right? It took a while. It, it, it was a little painful, but we got it. And I'm actually happy with it, which in the end, that's all that matters. So thank you so much for joining me for another episode of a 30 second card in six minutes and seven seconds. Or did I say seven or eight seconds? I don't remember what I said. Anyway, seven seconds, he says. So six minutes, seven seconds. Thank you so much for, sh for, staring, for, for, for sharing with me, staring with me. I will see you again soon. Bye-bye. <laughs>